Hello. Metabase allows users to explore multiple data sources with simple and intuitive controls that can really generate powerful reports and stunning visualizations. This allows you to show your library's value to your stakeholders. You can use interactive charts on public dashboards to present at meetings and more. You can even subscribe to reports and have them delivered to your inbox on a particular schedule. This is all automated with our setup. It really, really makes things easy to turn your data into clear answers and questions. You can really make this data-driven decision with confidence to move your library closer to your strategic roles. So let's talk about what you can do within Metabase. You'll see here once I'm logged in, over on the left-hand side, we have some examples set up in our system. This allows you to really personalize your collection so you could look at different types of data. So for example, let's take a look at our Koha data. You can see we have several different reports in here, whether we're looking at checkouts by hour of the day, this will give us a clear look at the times when we can see our highest checkouts are at. So we could see at 8 a.m. during our check-in time, we can see that we have checkouts at 103 um, in the morning pretty early and then there in the mid-afternoon. If we go back, we can look at everything from a patron category. So if we want to see where our highest categories are at, we can see all of that information. And these allow you to set this up pretty, pretty easily within your system. Um, this is all pulling from our Koha system and displaying that information um, within the system. Now, public dashboards are a great way for you to show this to um, the public. So maybe you want to present something on your library website, or you're doing a presentation for your city or your county. This is a fantastic way to push that information out. So we can see checkouts, we can see returns, we can see the number of checkouts by week and branch code, um, damaged items, date last seen, items from a collection, and so much more. Um, on order items with holds. I mean, this is limitless. It's just a great way to visualize all of your information in one place. And again, this can be set up pretty easily um, to pull that information directly from your Koha system. You know, if you're looking to see the number of patrons that were um, created in your system, you know, in the last 90 days or 120 days, whatever the time frequency is, you can easily set that information up. So this is a nice way to do that. Now within your system, you can personalize any information. So you can see this is showing me the last reports that I've run so I can easily jump back in. Within Metabase, you can create a question and that's a guided report that will walk you through um, data structures. So, you know, I can pick the data that I want to look at. So let's say my Koha system, I can pick the tables and then easily create that. So I don't have to know that much SQL. I can just bring in that information and add it. The next option is an SQL query, and that really lets me translate it from Koha reports. So if you're using a Koha report, you can bring that SQL right in, or if you use the Koha reports library, another great way to do that. Dashboards are a way for you to visually arrange multiple reports within the system. So if I wanted to create that public dashboard, I could. If I wanted to create a public dashboard for my collection development folks, I can absolutely do that. And they can be public or they can be just for a set of users. So this is a nice way that you can really customize your Metabase um, within the system. So Metabase is a great way for you to visualize information and really take your reports to the next level.